Hey friends, you're watching Relevant News, where we're talking about what's trending in faith and culture. And today, Pope Francis is trending for his controversial support of Juan Barros, a bishop in Chile accused of covering up sexual abuse. According to the Washington Post, Barros is accused of shielding a high-profile priest accused of sexual assault, even though a Chilean judge and the Vatican deemed the testimonies of his alleged victims to be credible. During a week-long trip to Chile, Pope Francis reportedly met and prayed with sexual abuse victims, asking forgiveness for the irreparable damage they suffered as children. But the Holy Father has expressed doubts about the claims against Barros, claiming that the allegations are calumny, meaning slander. The Pope's defense of the bishop could be undermining his efforts for reconciliation and the credibility of the church itself. His comments have enraged many in the country where 45% of the population identifies as Catholic and sparked protests and even vandalism. 11 Catholic churches have been burned. One of Barro's high-profile accusers, author Juan Carlos Cruz, took to Twitter explaining, we will not be intimidated by anyone in the fight to stop sexual abuse, even if it's someone as powerful as the Pope. This has to stop and survivors need to be believed and respected. It seems that Pope Francis is wanting to give compassion to both the victim and the victimizers in the situation. But in this hashtag Me Too, Church Too moment, those who are concerned about justice want more than kind words and real tears and sincere prayers. They want change, beginning with the resignation of Bishop Juan Barros. That's all for Relevant News. Make sure you check us out on Twitter at Relevant or our website, relevantmagazine.com. See you next time.